Hi guys and welcome to my channel and now in this video uh, I will tell you about how to check the pending orders or remaining orders of uh, the orders you have played, placed this is the main screen uh, now we will go over here and we will write M E 2 L M E 2 L then press enter then this screen will appear what will you do you have to write your vendor over here now scope of list scope of list it must be selected as ALV otherwise the report generation pattern or layout will not be comfortable now document type you have to write ZLPO now you will write document date over here what uh, what I am doing in this report that I have mentioned my vendor that I want to know the pending order detail of my vendor this this vendor and whatever the POs I have issued him from 1st March to 10th April so I'll get the detail of pending orders of this vendor as per this date range no you can use uh, by anything you can write only material also and remove uh, keep the vendor blank or however you want because there are many options you can generate the report as per your requirement but over here I am just want to know the pending order of my this vendor as per the date range of this now I'll press enter okay one more thing that uh, uh, if in, in selection parameter if you will select WE101 so it will show you the POS only those POS in which there is some pending quantity remaining and now means that if I run the report without mentioning anything over here keeping my selection parameter blank so all the POS which have been uh, issued from 1st March to 10th April uh, if deliveries have come and if not remaining uh, is completed all details all PO information will be available but if I select WE101 so it will only show those POs which are only pending but currently I don't want to see I want to see the PO detail uh, which will be including all the POs which are pending and which are not now I will click over here now you can see the report is available that it's showing the vendor name purchase order number purchase order and uh, number uh, to number date material now quantity which I order to, to be delivered means what quantity is pending the plant the price of that material to be invoiced is still to be invoiced and released now what is this showing that on 3rd March I placed a order to do this supplier material this the order quantity was 250 kg and to be delivered is zero means supplier has delivered all the quantity against this PO now if you see this PO that supplier has has yet not delivered this material the order was placed on 19th March but still the order has not been delivered now in this view you can see that 1500 kg was ordered from which 1100 kg is pending means only 400 kg supplier has delivered so this is the pending report detail it shows you the complete purchase order detail which you have sent to your supplier from this you can know that how which purchase orders are left to be delivered like this like these POs in which quantity is still to be delivered and these are the POs in which the supplier has delivered all the material now same like uh, uh, previously you can click this button and you can check if any uh, other columns you need to add any other information you need to add so you can add that also 
no to be invoice is still to be delivered it means that the po was of 250 kg and to be invoiced means uh, you have the supplier has not sent its invoice of this quantity so it's showing that uh, it still needs to be invoiced i hope that you would have liked the video so if you have liked then please like comment share and subscribe to my channel and if you have any confusion and question then you can ask it in comment department thank you